Hey y'all, welcome back to another video. Today we're gonna go over the newest uh, Louis Vuitton Woody case, which is the sunglass case. I actually purchased this because my Chanel sunglasses come in this super big, super thick um, case, which is really awesome because it's really, really hard and heavy duty. So when you put it in your bag, like nothing's gonna happen to your sunglasses. However, if I'm carrying like a crossbody bag, something small, this is really bulky and this fits in like nothing. Or if it does fit in something, this is the only thing that I can put in my bag. So I wanted something a little bit more compact than this that I could put my sunglasses in and keep them safe. Um, instead of carrying this, usually what I end up doing is I just throw my sunglasses into my bag <laughs> and that's not healthy <laughs> for them. So we're gonna unbox this. It's from the newest collection, the By the Pool. I had my sales associate um, order this for me because everything else had come out from the collection except for this and I think the niece. And so I messaged her and I was like, hey, is this still coming out? Here's the product code, please. And she was like, oh, wow, yeah, let me get that for you. And when I went to pick this up, um, she was really interested in it because the store that I go to doesn't usually order the sunglass cases so they didn't even have any at all come in except for the one that I ordered. So it was really really exciting to get this. I also like that the dust bag actually fits. You know a lot of the times they're giving you your product and they like, don't even fit. Um, but here she is in her full glory and of course I'll put um, close-ups but you can see uh, it's one piece of canvas in like the pink yellow gradient. I also like that it's normal size monogram instead of the giant monogram. Super not into the giant monogram. The bottom here is Vachetta and when you open it, this is also Vachetta. Um, and it says made in France. So the one of course, the like first thing is you're going, oh my god, this is going to get dirty. <laughs> Um, which is true, but it's not going to be exposed to light the way that your like bag handles are. So I'm really hoping that it ends up looking good uh, and it ages really well. And then it's got the yellow stitching around the Vachetta. The, it is magnetic. It's a really nice magnet closure. And then inside it's got some tissue. Not tissue. It's like styrofoamy, thin styrofoam. And then it has the um, product code and it says coated fabric and cowhide exterior textile lining. It's got like the pink microfiber on the inside, which is really pretty. Um, and also in here, and then it's got glazed edges. So I think you can see this and you're like, oh my God, that's going to get really dirty. And you're totally right. It is going to get totally dirty. Um, so my essay was like, I don't know that Chanel sunglasses are going to fit in there. So moment of truth those bad boys fit oh <laughs> they don't fit um ooh, oof you see that that does not fit <laughs> that is not closing that's not closing at all hmm. I think these would probably do fine with sunglasses that have um that are flat god they ugh. They just look like they should fit. Mm. I mean, if I really wanted to push it, uh, I mean, that's not terrible. Depends on how you feel about your products wearing as to whether that fits or not. Um, that's definitely gonna warp the case a little bit. However, this is, you know, leather, leather stretches. So it really just kind of depends it's even worse if I try and flip it around. It's better if the uh, sunglasses go Ugh, there. I don't know. I don't hate it. it. Doesn't really bother me. I have to think about that. This might just be a piece that sits, you know, in my uh, in my collection just to stare at. I'm sure all of you guys have stuff that you buy and you just end up staring at it instead of using it. You know what I'm talking about. It's just so pretty. You can't leave it at the store. It has to live in your collection forever. So yeah, that is um, all I've got on this little guy. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!